This inkline is my only friend here in this puddle of sludge. How's it going, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Splatoon 2. Last time we took on Stage 22 here in Octo Canyon, the first Encephalon HQ Underground Expressway, where we got our final hero weapon, the Hero Brush. This time, we're going to be super jumping to Stage 23, which is on this rotating platform, which when you super jump to, it automatically goes. It's really, really cool. And uh, we will be taking that level on, which I can't read it right now while I'm making this turn. Actually, I can just automatically make it turn again. Yay! We'll be taking on stage 23, the Octo Galaxy, one with the Cosmos. And of course, there is yet another Sheldon request. Without any further ado, let's do this one more time. If fitting that we're super jumping, this is like freaking Super Mario Galaxy. Let's enter and get started. Or not. Alright, it looks like we're going to be using the Hero Duelies again. Man, it's been a while. Well, maybe it hasn't been exactly a while, because, I mean, I haven't recorded in a little bit compared to usual with this series. Uh, but for me, it feels like it's been a while since uh, I've recorded with the Duelies, or played a level with the Duelies, I should say. Alright, so this level in particular is pretty fun. We can just skip a whole bunch of that stuff, and I wish I could skip it. But I ended up, well, I mean, I kind of skipped it. It's not as much as I would have liked. And come, please, can I just go here and do the fancy stuff? All right, let's go over here, activate the Octo Balloon. There we go, or whatever it's called. Someone's still alive over, really? Really? You somehow lived. Are you kidding me? Anyway, uh, so yeah, this level is pretty cool. It has that thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and move on now, because I don't know what that is. Alright, so we have these ink jets here, ink pistons, jets, pistons, it's, it's the same thing, they're the same mechanics when you think about it. And they go up and down, which means we're gonna also have to move back and forth depending on each thing. Pretty unique! And there's also some more fun stuff coming up right here. So, I want to head into this cannon, because I want to activate these balloons here, take out these uh, octocopters. There we go, activate that balloon as well. So now, here comes the fun part. Go over here, come here, swim. Make sure we land on this thing, there we go, perfect. Head on to the jets, excellent, perfect. Alright, we played that very excellently. Now, I'm not going to lie, this might be the first time that we're going to have to come back into a level because of the sunken scroll. I'm really hoping not, and I did grab the Sardinium on my first try, which is very good, because I probably would have just died and reset for that. Alright, let's make our way up here. Hopefully we can make it before the... Ew! God, that was close. <laughs> that was real close. Uh, so... This is the fun part coming up. You see there's a bunch of ink pistons here. We also need to make sure we go on a platform over there or over there to get the sunken scroll. So this is gonna be fun. And I could just not... <laughs> okay, that's great. I'm just gonna do this normally. Uh, I was going to do the fancy tricks with the dualies to... Actually, I can just do it right here. I don't need to do that there. This thing again, I don't really know what it is, but it's whatever. Alright, now it's time to pay close attention, because if I fail this, I'm not gonna let myself down. Also, I might have already failed it. I'm not exactly sure. I think I did. Yeah, I think I failed it. Oh, the sunken scroll's over there, is it? Or it's over there and over there, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, you know what? I don't even care. I'm gonna restart. I'll be right back. Well, the good news is it only took one try to get the Sardinium again, so that's nice. Hopefully it only takes one more try to get the Sunken Scroll here as well. Alright, let's jump over here. 
and I need to move over to this one. There we go. I don't know how I missed that earlier. It's it's whatever. It's the it's, it's fine. All right, take you out from above. Wow, I actually didn't think that would work. And the sunken scroll is right here. Okay, I was <laughs> good. I was maybe thinking that was just a boxed um, incline, so I would have to go to a different area. But no, that was the sunken scroll indeed. So I did make the right call. All right, there we go, and now we're back to where I reset the level. <laughs> Hopefully I don't have to do that again. All right, here we go. Let's make our way up here. Destroy you. Actually, I think it's smooth sailing from here, Octo Slob. All right, jump through the grate with the uh, ink jump. There we go. Excellent. Final checkpoint. All right. Oh, we have back and forth moving uh, ink pistons, so just be careful, especially with uh, standing up and... Binga, ink, inky, inky. There we go. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. I'm just gonna do that now. Okay, I, I, I got it. I'm not even gonna bother with it. I, I did it. I'm in my underwear, kind of, but I did it. Yay! And it only took one reset, so fine by me. Really fine by me, actually. Do you ever think, man, this place is ugly. My evil lair could use some pizzazz? Well, just whip out some sparkly fabric and tape and get your decorate on. It looks great, feels great, and it's fun. Give it a try and stay fresh. Some more tips from Callie. Yeah, I think she's working with the Octarians. They're dropping a lot of clues. Anyway, with that, man, I was so nervous at the end. I probably sounded so awful with my commentary there. Anyway, of course, Marie, you're welcome. Many thanks are not needed, although they are appreciated because, I mean, I, I kind of work for free. <laughs> anyway, let's return to Inkopolis Square and let's partake in some good old-fashioned Turf War. Today, we'll be playing Turf War on Piranha Pit Yet another returning stage from the first Splatoon. Alright, so it's actually- wow, it's green versus pink, which are the Splatoon 2 colors. Wow, that's actually a nice coincidence. Alright, well, Piranha Pit pretty much works the same as it did before. Uh, you just need to splat the enemies there. Uh, you need to make sure everything is hunky-dory. I'm gonna just do all this. I'm just gonna splat everything here. Perfect. I know you're down here, so I'm going to take care of you. Uh, or you're going to take care of me. <laughs> Dang you, Axel Foley. Why aren't you making another Beverly Hills Cop movie? Uh, or I guess I should say Eddie Murphy. Axel Foley's just the character. Oh, no. There's the rain cloud. I'm going to get out of... Really? Uh, really? How did I not hit him? I splatted him, a, like, a good five times. At least my buddy there, G and K Destroy, got the, uh, got the, uh, cleanup there, I guess you can say. All right, let's take a look at the map. <laughs> of course. Okay, uh, you are down there. I'm going to... Where are you? Oh, you're right here, and I'm gonna get splatted because I ran out of ink. That's cool. All right, uh, oh, my team's handling their side of the base, which is good, I guess, which actually is good, considering we get to distract them. Oh, oh god, I'm gonna get taken out, aren't I? Oh, yep, I'm gonna get taken out. Where, what, my, where does my teammate that was just up above there? Did he die? No, he didn't die, but he's not doing anything. What? Dude, why aren't, <sighs> seriously, buddy, you, you gotta, you gotta do stuff on our base here. You, and you gotta take care of the enemy, you can't just not, you know? Speaking of, I'm just gonna use my special here just to clean this up quicker. Okay. Oh, hello, dude. You're infuriating. Okay, this... I don't under... Alright, I'm just gonna fall in the wall. I got Axel Foley, you know what? I will take that. I will gladly take that. It's not much of a trade, but, I mean... I, I guess it works. Uh, oh, yeah, we're getting utterly destroyed. This is 
this is not looking all that great. Uh, let's just do... Really? Come on. How... Come on, dude. Are you serious? Come on. How did I not hit anybody? Dude. Ugh. I've just been having bad luck with Turf War the last... Like, I don't know. The last several... Several... Matches I've done. Okay, at least I got... Thibault? Is that how you would pronounce that name? I don't know. Thibault, maybe? I don't know. That's a weird way to pronounce it. Uh, I don't think we're gonna do anything in the last couple seconds here, because I can't really even get out of my spawn area. Yeah, we we just got utterly destroyed, so pink is apparently the better Splatoon 2 color than green. I mean, the pink color is the color of the two in Splatoon 2's logo, so I guess it makes sense. But I did get... Wow, really? Miyuku didn't even do anything on the team? Did they disconnect or something? I I don't know. Anyway, with that, that is going to do it for this episode of Splatoon 2, where pink is the dominant color. <laughs> Next time, we will head back into Octo Canyon, and of course, we will do yet another ranked battle. So with that, thank you for watching, and until next time, catch you later.